Manchester United once didn't concede from a Premier League penalty at Old Trafford for more than a decade. During Sir Alex Ferguson's legendary reign, the Red Devils repeatedly faced accusations of being favoured by officials. They grew stronger between 1993 and 2004, with only three spot kicks awarded to visiting sides in the league at the Theatre of Dreams in that time. After Rule Fox successfully converted his for Norwich City in December 1993, Former Leicester City midfielder Muzzy Izzet, Middlesbrough cult hero Junin, and Blackburn Rovers legend David Dunn all missed their efforts. It wasn't until Danny Murphy found the back of the net from 12 yards for Liverpool on this day, April 24, in 2004 that the duck was broke. Fergie has denied ever influencing referees but many figures have come out and admitted he and his players knew the right buttons to push, including former defender Phil Neville. When discussing their great rivalry with Arsenal, he once said, I do say over my time in these games, I think we got the better decisions by the referees. And I think it was a big bugbear of the Arsenal players and Arsene Wenger the way that probably referees tended to favor us. We were experienced, we knew how to play the referees, we knew the words to say to them, we knew the right time to put pressure on them. It's something that they, Arsenal, were learning but we were probably the masters at it. Sir Alex himself told reporters ahead of his impending retirement in 2013, the fourth official on Sunday showed me the board and it said eight minutes. I said, think again. That's been a part of it, the pressure you try and put on referees. But I saved mind games for opponents. Howard Webb was one ref who faced more accusations of bias than most. He addressed them in his autobiography, The Man in the Middle. Let's get something straight, once and for all, he wrote. Contrary to what you might have seen on the internet, I never shared a bed with Sir Alex Ferguson. There is no statue of me outside Old Trafford. My kids are not called Rio, Wayne and Cristiano. There is no Red Devil tattoo ink on my left buttock. The only United I have ever supported, hand on heart, is of the Rotherham variety. And that's the whole truth and nothing but the truth.